This is Lee the Appraiser back for another segment of Amazing Appraising here in our beautiful, spacious, brand new APR 50 Sampin Gallery on the corner of 57th Street and 7th Avenue. Okay, great. This is one of the more fabulous photographs taken of Miss, oops, we're holding this here, Miss Marilyn Monroe. Okay. Um, by the way, uh, we are going to have a um, on our website and I think on our YouTube channel we're going to be talking I have to do this we have one of only two paintings that she made that she painted purportedly in her lifetime one has been lost and disappeared and we I believe have the only other one it's a self-portrait that Marilyn Monroe made obviously of this a self-portrait so she made it of herself and she made it with the paint brushes and all that stuff that was given to her or lent to her by her close friend. I think her name is uh, Susan Strasberg. Uh, her parents were Lee Strasberg, the famous art, the famous um, actor's studio and act te acting teachers. And the daughter, uh, Susan, became close with her. And um, she, um, she painted these two self-portraits of which only one exists and we have it we'll be talking about that at a later date you make sure you can continue to listen to our show for more updates on that so this is a beautiful large uh, um, photograph of Meryl Monroe this came from a very famous photographer by the name of Bert Stern and uh, it's called from her la it's called the last sitting so this was taken right these group of photos were taken right before she passed away. This is the one of the very earliest renditions that he uh, printed and sold. Uh, our guess is it's about 1975 to 1980. He only made 25 of these. This is number 10, it's a good number. Number 10 of 25. And so he numbered it, he wrote Marilyn, 1962 and he signed it now as you see the quality the picture is extraordinary it's an incredible pose and it actually still has the original Sotheby Park Bernay label in the lower left corner Sotheby Park Bernay of course was the and still is the uh, premier seller of high-end art in the world they're selling on a yearly basis they sell not hundreds of millions but actually billions with it be billions of dollars worth of high-end art they've sold like Andy Warhol's for you know 200 million dollars uh, uh, Picasso's for tens of millions all these famous artists uh, da Vinci or everybody so um, this is an incredibly beautiful photograph it's uh, probably one of the very first editions they ever made of her. Um, I'm uh, saying probably in the 1970s. It's one of the lowest printings, only 25 made max, and signed by the artist, um, and signed Marilyn, dated, and signed. Really one of the more incredible, beautiful pictures of Miss Marilyn Monroe, and obviously it's clearly authentic it's something that we will give a lifetime certificate on uh, if necessary we'll do that for sure and it also has the original auction house tags that this was sold close to 50 years ago crazy so um now they make different levels of these prints that means they made later editions where they made larger quantities those obviously sell for less as our uh, research dictates this is probably the rarest most beautiful and most in demand series of this early uh, photo uh, photograph. Okay, so again, this is a Bert Stern, Marilyn Monroe photograph, the last sitting, um, and um, really a stunning example of this piece. If you have anything, number one, you have anything by Bert Stern. Number two, you have anything rare, nice of Marilyn Monroe. We love the pieces, we we'll buy them, we collect them, Anything unusual and rare you have for any of her letters, signatures, photographs, anything about her, uh, pictures with Joe DiMaggio, we handle the borough signed by them, um, documents. Uh, many years ago, we had a gentleman came in here with a 
little napkin that had red lipstick on it with a kiss on it. It was um, impressed on the napkin, the kiss, so you saw red lips there with a beautiful kiss. And it was loving kisses to Jimmy or whatever it was, loving kisses, Miss Meryl Monroe. Beautiful. Um, we bought that, again, this was like 35 years ago. That was bought and sold to a very good friend of mine who unfortunately passed a few years ago, Mr. Bert Podell, the famous um, accountant and music management, uh, financial management company right around the block here. Uh, he used to be a ball boy for the New York Yankees, a very good friend, a very good client, a uh, very cool thing that we had. So you have anything by Marilyn Monroe, you have anything by Elvis Presley, anybody, James Dean, um, presidents, uh, Abraham Lincoln, George Washington, any cool stuff, we'd love to buy, sell, and appraise it. Uh, if we like it, we will offer you a lot of money for it, and it would be your uh, privilege to cash out in today's very high market prices. So if you have anything, please let us know. We're happy to look, evaluate, and appraise anything you may have.